Hassan, we are gonna be doing this. So, we are gonna be doing this. We are gonna be doing this. Nangara, 35 year old, going to 36, but God has blessed me to 18. God has blessed me to 18. Sound. Yo, Brenda's point of view. Another day, another way. When you learn to compare, to attack at to create content, ambayo it is a co impact on somebody's life, ama on somebody's relationship out there in a positive manner. Now this time Brenda, nataka uzungumzie usafi. Katika ndoa, <laughs> katika labda hata watoto, katika hata tu mtu ambaye labda yako single na hayuko tayari ku mingle, usafi is very crucial. Lakini mimi naye nataka niweze kuuiongelele like um, kwa couples, alafu mwenyewe utaona vinyo unaweza kai breakdown, but especially couples. Mimi my issue hapa ni jamaa ametoka ameenda hustle ya kila siku kutafuta mkate. Madam pia labda pia naye akona shughuli ambayo anafanya just for the same purpose ya kuona kwamba wame meet bills za kila siku ama bills za kimwezi. Unaona? Mm -hmm. Now the issue is katika harakati ya kupanda hii pikipiki itakufikisha huku hii gari mtu alikalia hapa mwingine alitapika hapa mwingine alikuwa ananuka mkojo mwingine labda alikuwa ajijipanguza vizuri unajua ni mambo mengi tu huko nje wakati una mingle so ya sawa tu 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 si duela hapo si ndo so now the issue is eh usafi do you think uh, ni poa kama mtu anaoga mara moja kwa siku ama mara mbili ama hata zaidi ya yeah. Personally, because it's like these people are working. So if they are working, it is quite conducive for them to shower more than twice. So they, it's good to shower twice in a day, morning before you get to people out there. So that after you, the impression you create, the way you are clean, unajua. Now, when I say cleanliness is next to godliness. Right. Say, you are meeting ata with other colleagues, with your customers. Lazima ukwe presentable, lazima ukwe fresh, so that ata watu wasi ogope kujia karibu na wewe. Now, when you get out of your working space, urudi nyumbani, it's only fair to yourself because ume mingle, na watu, kuna ile ta dirt in the air, ukuje tena, you take another shower. Now, once una take shower, after we, after any yani business hours umekuja kwa nyumba inakusaidia hata wewe mwenyewe ku feel relaxed unaona unasikia hata uchovu ya the day imewear out but unakuja hivyo imagine umejipaka mafuta hiyo mafuta when you get out there kuna dust hata inakuja inakuushika ngozi then unakuja unalalia malazi yako unajua hiyo inamaanisha definitely hata your beddings are dirty the towel that utatumia in the morning kujipanguza sawa na you want to be clean pia una identify unaona so kwangu it's just good mtu akishawa twice in a day na especially for couples how can you spend a night na nyu wote huyu ananuka huku makwapa huyu ananuka huku hivi na hata apart from showering hata nini brushing your your teeth unaona ni vizuri tu unakuja you brush twice in a day ndio hata hiyo breath ikwe sawa sometimes hata mimi wana meet with people sasa siezi john my personal side mimi naeleza kwa nanukia ama sinuki but whatever pia mimi na experience sometimes hata utaki mtu akuje close to you because hata mdomo inanuka because hata mwenyewe ananuka these chairs mimi naitumia we utaitumia another person atakuja itumie na you don't know hygiene ya huyo mtu iko aje so imagine you are sharing hata a chair alafu ati unaenda hautaoga utaka hivyo definitely that is that unaona mm -hmm. this public vehicle zata your personal car kuna mwingine hata labda kuna boy luko chini uko chini, na, uko eh, chini. inatoa hiyo kamaji kidogo alafu umekalia you are not clean once you get out of your home you are just dirty but at least not that dirty because you've showered but dirt equal to everywhere so it's good to keep yourself 
clean. Alafu kwa couples apart from hata showering, hata at least una unajishave. Kuna that shaving aspect, you know where to shave. Wapi na wapi? Shave Sema, hizo areas. Eh? Kuna kuna mtaa, <laughs> kuna mtaa haifai guso hata kidogo. Eh? Wapi na wapi? For couples hata shave each other. Makwapa shave each other. Aha. Private parts shave each other because we ndata kuona vizuri uh, kagwe kagwe vizuri a shave kwe neat na tena usijikate unajua kama ni peke yako kuna venye unaweza jikata but we uh, eh so at least msaidiane msaidiane ku achieve the desired goal alafu ndio when you shower because mwingine ana shower but ukiangalia armpit akinua mkono juu like dressing code kai yangu ya leo mtu akinua mkono juu unaona uko kwa makwapa iko whitish whitish yani kuna hiyo sweat ime mix na hiyo nywele you just look that and not presentable so kwangu it's just good to maintain a personal hygiene whether couples whether individually or whatever yani personal hygiene is very key so, na twice no. in a day better na kipimo ama ile kitu ya kupima usafi ni mtu mwenyewe anafaa apime usafi ajue yeye hey, hapa hivi nimefika kwa level ya usafi ya hali ya juu ama labda pia inafaa kama uko na challenge ya usafi mm-hmm. that is eh? ama inafaa labda pia uanze kuwa mtu labda kama ni matandiko ama malazi uanze kutumia vitu white 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 ama wengine naona mtu anasema ah mimi pilo ya white sitaki kwa nini hataki pilo ya white kwa nini hataki labda sheet za white inakuwa kwa hiyo una feel like malazi ya couple siwe white ama iwe ama iwe black ama hizi colors ambazo zinaficha uchafu because pia wengine wanaona like wacha tuficha uchafu ndio labda malazi labda itabadilishwa baada ya muda on a personal level natumia hata sheets za black yes na as long as najua i shower in the morning i shower before bed mm-hmm. unaona mm-hmm. na every weekend i change my beddings plus towel mm-hmm. zinaoshwa mm-hmm. hiyo inamaanisha Personally whichever color it doesn't matter. Ni the routine of changing them. Mm. Are you changing them labda at a twice in a week, once in a week, but kwangu yani it should not ex- exceed once in a week. Because imagine society hiyo shuka umekanayo for long period despite kuoga kuna venyata ukilala unaweza sweat. Kwa hivyo tuseme in so, si rangi. Si rangi. Ni muda. Ni muda na ni muda yani generally tu ni muda na kwangu alafu pia tena nafikiri itategemea pia na na labda kuna siku yenye unaweza kuata mtu mzima hivi ni ukweli labda haukojoi kwa malazi wakati umelala mm-hmm. it doesn't happen but mara moja pia unashitukia unaota ile ndoto ya kitoto <laughs> eh ndio huyo umechezacheza mpira ama umechezacheza kidogo umeenda kwa fence pale by the time unashtuka umechafua kidogo na utaongoja muda uishe ama inabidi ubadilishe Obviously in cases unajua kuna cases hata za couple you know whatever goes on on that no, bed so ina inamaanisha inamaanisha personally sasa ni my experience <laughs> kuna times zenye <laughs> na take a lot of coffee night time yes. na mi mwenyewe na imagine at niko lu kuna siku hata nilikimbia when already nimesha sock bed na na pia vena nikimbia nikaenda lu am so eh ama labda ni this year tu 2022 <laughs> <laughs> so when when nilikuwa nakimbia kuenda kwa washroom yes. already messi ilikuwa kwa bed messi kona na mimi mwenyewe si unaona sa that time nilikuwa nishashawa twice already but at that moment tena ilibidi ni, at least nijioshe nikuje tena ni change beddings ni lale for the night but morning time tena niende ni a eh, hiyo mattress hiyo blanket na whatever but shuka nizioshe so unaona in rare cases inamaanisha you don't have to wait for a week but i'm just talking kwa cases zenye ziko normal mm-hmm. changing beddings maximum one week it's an it's good Alafu nafikiri usafi pia haukomei tu basi kwa kuoga, kubadilisha malazi. Pia kuna mtu basi anaoga lakini unapata anarudia zile nguo za jana. Mm-hmm. Ama hata zile nguo za ndani anarudia. Sasa inakuwa kwamba pia amesaidia sana kwa upande wa usafi ama anafanya ana, 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 ana plus one, alafu tunakuja nafanya minus one. 
unaona kama saizi velikuwa na kupea that example ya viti Yes. Viti hizi tunashia watu wengi. Mm -hmm. That vya kwenye unapanda kuna mtu mwingine alikalia the same spot enye unenda kalia. Hey. Pale, Na hata aka... mwingine ni mwenye kosawa but haja observe hygiene. Yes. Na ume enda umekalia po na you are observing the hygiene. Na manisha those clothes already ziko chafu. Unaona? So kwangu, kwanza especially undergarments. Izo ni vitu za kuchange kila siku. Kila siku. Yes. Na kwangu jioni sioni need ya kuvaa undergarments once umeoga mm -hmm. hey, ukirudi mm -hmm. nyumbani feel ebu, free ebu feel free uh -huh. yani kama si eti kukuwa na watoto hata walk naked but because ya watoto sasa at least cover yourself uh -huh. lakini sasa umejibana the whole day yes. wacha ta blood flow can't lose, can't lose. Hey, feel free mm -hmm. mm. kwangu vaa ngo vizuri but hata hiyo undergarments for the night you don't need them uh -huh. mm. but sasa Yo, whatever you've used during the day, wash it. Don't, don't, yani never. Mm. Usi hai rudia. Usi wai at any cost. Nafikiri siji kama labda kuna vitu labda katika mambo ya usafi umesahau? Kuna pia wengine wame maintain hygiene, but they have that natural order. Enye tu kuna ile arufu body flani, eh, body smell ile strong. Nani yako? Nani yako? Because mimi personally, ya, yeah. mm -hmm. ni maya encounter a person mwenye alikuwa close to me. Mm -hmm. Tulikuwa tunaishi na ye, na alikuwa na observer hygiene. Kwanza on her case, ya alikuwa na ugata more than twice in a day, yes. considering her condition. Yes. But, iyo smell ilikuwa distinct. Kwa mtuka uyo, anezangalia at least, anezaenda maybe kuna medically wanezona afanya nini. But if there is nothing, I think ishu kama ya kolon, si hizi zineza kuwa poa. Kudisguise the smell in a work. So in, in those cases, kama it can be handled medically or using yani sasa at least extra caution like using the colognes, perfumes, could disguise in as a kuapua. Because everyone and understand need your body yako. So if you understand it, try at least kuna that una maintain those levels. Makucha, nyuele, maskio, na unasema ni sababu unapata sometimes pia nyuele, muta zakuwa meoga kila siku kama na dada. Na kuna vitu ambao muna, muna, muna shuka style flani ambao inamaisha hawoshi kwa muda. Uh -huh. So inakuwa kwamba kimwili umeoga, lakini kuna pati ya mwili kama kwa sana ukichwa penye nywele hiko inakuwa imechukua mwili pata mtu ni msafi kabisa ame maintain msafi lakini kichwa kicho chake kinanuka so personally me to be logical mm. for a lady mwenye anashuka most ladies wanashuka for a maximum of a month yes kwangu maximum of a month is not bad mm. but ukibomoa hiyo nywele usiende tena uishuke immediately usi and not immediately mm. usiishuke before washing juu kuna wengine naona anakuja kwa salon anakuja na vumua whatever alikuwa ameshuka yes. then immediately wanaanza kumshuka ingine haoshi hapo hata for your hair Mm. Unajua pia hair inafai kwe healthy. For your hair to be healthy, pia kuna vitu zenye inafai observe. Mm. So at least when a maximum for a lady kushuka inafai kwe a month. So that pia sinuke kuna yo joto. Mm. Kuna yo joto pia unafili kwa kichwa. Mm. So a month maximum, wash your hair first before redoing. Iyo ineza kuwa poa sana. Alafu pia for a lady yo nyele hako, ukifunga kitamba itasaidia pia hygiene ya pilo. Because sa kuna yo mafuta unajipaka, kuna yo spray enye unaspray. When unilala tuivo kwa pilo without using kitamba, inachafua pia yo pilo case. Noona? So at least kuna kufunga yo. Masikio hata nilikuwa nimesa hau. But most of the people, yani imagine, unakana mtu, ukimwangali vi maybe ya sharing yo chaya za magari. <laughs> ukiangalia um, nini masikio yake we unaona tu already uchafu inaonekana from yani to the you looking from the outside so chukua at least your cotton bud ama a piece of cloth mostly hata mi one sometimes nachukua hiyo piece of cloth uneka na kama hata inaisha match stick then unatolea kama auna at that time your cotton buds uh -huh. but unatoa at least you clean those ears you clean alafu sometimes unaweza kosha clean umetoa uchafu but kuna hii part ya hapa hivi tu juu hapa hivi juu unachukua piece of cloth ama cotton wool umeweka kwa maji unaiwai part unaiwai pa hapo hivyo unakuwa clean 
kuna issue pia mapua mapua pia unachukua piece of cloth unajaribu kuingiza kidogo una clean una clean sometimes hata tu ni dusty not at necessarily ni mucus unaitengeneza una, una the nails for the ladies mostly wanapenda <coughs> sorry hiyo hata fake nails so unapata ziko long but kama ni long jaribu pia kuchukua kama hiyo ni hiyo sasa nitaka cotton wool na maji you clean una clean hapo at least you chafu it okay but if you can maintain short nails especially for men maintain it noona maintain na ladies always ni napeana na an excuse because wanapenda to long nails but at least it, 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 let it be long Ungeza. lakini at least maintain usafi chukua ka, ka cotton wool na maji panguza panguza hapo hivyo umaintain hiyo usafi unaona na for men nayo upande usafi ingine yenye ni notice pia inakwanga ngumu kwao ni socks socks pia ni a daily affair alafu for both genders viatu viatu zianikwa kwa jua zikauke vizuri sometimes hata sometimes ikwangi ati hata tini hiyo viatu ni baridi but tunajua kama ni close shoes umeva the whole day kuna venye umesweat kidogo so inakuwa na ile dampness so inafaa ikwe aired ndio ukivaa tena ukitoa isinuke juu kuna mwingine hata unaenda ugeni ama wageni wamekuja kukuvisit yana kwambia wanaharibu hali ya hewa because ametoa tu kiatu ama so the so kwamba pia kiatu mtu ajikaze wana pea zaidi ya moja definitely at least kwa na zaidi ya moja kwa hata na maximum of mbili kama uwezi ka, yani kama we ni mtu mwenye hali yako haiwezi kukuruhusu ukwe na nyingi at least kwa na mbili kwa hata basi na open na closed so that kumeva open hiyo hiyo closed at least ipumue unaona mm. hivyo ama kama ni closed mbili leo va hii kesho va hiyo ingine sometimes hata it's not like at you have much but the little you have ngua tu unaweza kuwa tuna mbili but osha osha na wengine huwa naona hata most ladies when it comes to jeans mtu aoshi mm-hmm. because ataki ifed na because of that aujui that unavaa kitu chafu me me for me na osha jeans na the is maintained mm-hmm. osha tu na basso haita fed haita fed but at least tutakuwa clean because u, sometimes unaanza kujiuliza mbona si, mimi hata maybe hata you have one partner but umeanza kujikuna kuna fani fani unaanza kujiuliza maswali ni because a perfect example of a dirty chair which what the public wanatumia na we pia being one of the people utatumia umeenda hata kama sasa hizi kuna hii rush ya kwenda safari kwa mkwenda ku register mambo ya lines umeenda umekaa kwa hizo viti you don't know the person mwenye alikaa hapo jana juzi na oreva na wewe umeenda umekalia hapo you are imagining at that jeans you don't want to wash imebeba that flan nimewepeana example ya mtu mwa kona boil na ina nini ama hata yeye pia ako na hizi ma, ma infections za STIs na amekalia hiyo kiti wewe unaenda unakalia hapo that's the reason you are not washing the clothes that's the reason you are getting those infections too unaona mm-hmm. so personal hygiene ni key okay so ina maana kwamba that is not the end of the discussion it's not it ni just but a few that's not the end of the discussion mm-hmm. so ina maana kwamba wale ambao wamekuwa nasi katika video hii ama katika Ucha, ni ucha, ni ucha? uchambuzi sawa <laughs> <laughs> so, wale ambao wamekuwa nasi katika video hii wanaweza still bado wakatochea comments hawa na feel watu waoge mara mbili ama hata mtu labda waoge mara moja kwa wiki like, lakini kusema kweli mimi nitaenda na Brenda's point of view lakini everybody else out there uko na freedom ya kuchagua maisha yako vile unataka kuendesha sisi tuwesema tu tumepick on that topic tuweze kuona kama inaweza ka bring mwanga kidogo katika jamii so that is all thank you brenda